Alright guys, so I'm going to show you guys how to get photos as your background or your springboard background without having the same photo as your uh, lock screen background because you can do that on winter board but I want two separate pictures. Alright, what you're going to want to do is uh, have a jailbroken iPod touch or iPhone. Uh, go into Cydia. I'm going to pause this because Cydia takes a long time online. Alright, I'm back. Now uh, you want to go to search. And what you want to search is screw. Spelled S K R E. Whoops. God damn it. S K R E W. God fucking damn it. There. Yeah. And you'll see those two apps. Screw Common and V Wallpaper. You wanna uh, get both of them. Install both of them. I already have them, so I don't need to. And uh, you'll just go back and uh, you'll see video wallpaper. Mine's right there. And uh, you want to go into video wallpaper real fast before we SSH anything. Alright, go to video wallpaper and uh, go to select videos. Or select video. And uh, you'll see some videos that it's already got. Delete all those videos because you do not want those on there or you won't be able to set the picture as the background. Once you have all those deleted, then just go back. Now what you want to do before we SSH, go to your app store. And you don't have to do this, but uh, we're going to do this. Because this is where I always get my uh, backgrounds. You're just going to search backgrounds like this and you'll find this app, install it, it's free. Once you have that installed, go into it, backgrounds. Actually, hold on real quick. I'm going to pause this. Alright, so what you're going to do is, uh, it's got popular, recent, category, or search. I'm going to go to category and I'm going to go to nature because I got some pretty cool looking backgrounds. So I'm going to pick this world right here. That's pretty nice looking. Alright, what you want to do, don't save it. Or wait, yes, you do have to save it. So save that picture. It'll save to your photos. And go home. Go to your photos and go to saved photos. Go down to the picture you just saved, which is right here. And what you're going to need to do, alright, and to get that off, or whoops, make all that stuff get off to where it's just a picture. And what you're going to need to do is hold the home button and press the power button to take a picture of it again. And you gotta do this because uh, the photo won't show up when you SSH unless you do this. And you just see it flash. And we go out, go back to the photos. And you should have two of them now. Alright, now you're ready to SSH. So go to your desktop computer. Actually, you're not SSHing yet, but uh. And go to my desktop and uh you're gonna plug in your iPod. I'm just gonna set the camera down real fast. Alright. It's plugged in. Exit off the Alright. Now what you wanna do is go to my computer. And you'll 
you'll see your Apple iPod. Right click that and hit explore. And hmm, I have three of those pictures for some reason. But you'll see your picture here. Now just uh, minimize that for right now and click off that. Now go to your WinSCP or your SSH tool. Whatever you use to SSH. Uh, Alright, let me just log in. Alright, All right, now what you're going to want to do is once you're here, backspace once, go into mobile. Go to media, go to screw, and you'll see VW background. Don't click on it, just make sure it's there. Now you open your iPod back up, and what you do is just drag whatever photo you want to the VW background. So we're going to drag that there. I didn't even drag it. Try that again. Oh. My bad, my bad. Alright. Real fast. I'm sorry. Uh, minimize that. Go on your desktop and make a new folder. And just name it whatever. I'm just going to type a whole bunch of different letters. And, uh, drag the photo you want to that. And so now when you open that folder you just made, you should see your photo. Alright. Now we can exit off the iPod. Now go back to WinSCP. Open that folder. Now, oops, can't really see that. There we go. So, recap. We plugged the iPod in, uh, went to the photos, um, you just make a new folder on your desktop, name it whatever, and take a photo from your iPod and drag and drop it into that folder, open that folder up, um, and you're going into your backspacing once on WinSCP, going into mobile, media, and you'll see screw. You'll click that, and you open up your folder you just made with your picture, and you just drag and drop your picture into the VW background. It'll ask you to copy. You hit copy. And it's done. We can click out of that. We can click out of this. Okay. Go back to the iPod. And now uh, we go back to video wallpaper. Gotta hurry up, I'm running out of time. Click video wallpaper. Make sure you're, you don't have any videos in your select video. Hit the enable video will be off. Gotta turn that on. Go to select picture. And uh, you'll see a whole bunch of pictures. Just find the one you just put on there. It'll say, yes, I want. And you hit home. And as you see, it did not change nothing. It, and on the V wallpaper, it says that you don't have to respring, but you do. So I'm just going to respring real fast. And again, if once you respring and it's not on there, just click on any app. See, like how it's black. 
Uh, just click on any app. I'm going to go to Winterboard and then just hit home. And there you go. Now it's on there. So that's how you get photos as your springboard wallpaper. I know it sounds pretty confusing, but once you get, you know how to do it, it's real easy. Uh, comment, rate, subscribe.